Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Unogoshe Kumalo and this is a very special episode. As you guys have probably seen, I am not at my usual office, so already you know what something is happening. I'm at the YX24 Fest, which is brought to you by YouthX by NetBank. Thank you so much for tuning in once again, I'm Ganami. I really hope you guys enjoy this video. I am going to be doing so much, but trust me, I need you guys to trust me on this. I'm going to be having some people that I'm talking to. I'm going to show you guys this event, but I'm also going to talk a bit more about the My Goals account, which I have been chatting about throughout my channel, but don't stress. And if you are tuning in on my YouTube, drop me a comment, a send a new roll call. Let's see if you guys are actually listening. So I'm going to ask you to first, please tell us your name. Yep. And then tell us why you applied for the Youth X Awards. So my name is Neon Toling. I'm coming from the first state. My name is Mzirona Anokunda. My name is Gosi. Gosi? Yeah, yeah. Oh, King, right? Yes, I am. Hey, my name is Asivile Montile. My name is Akonam Tongana. My name is Sarokin Malinda. My name is Brandon Mashaba. Um, I'm from Sosha Nguve. Uh, my name is Brighton Maharela, also known as Fanosi. Oh, my name is Tobazan Klava. Oh, okay. And yeah, I'm from the East Rand, from Takana to be specific. Uh, my name is Nganye Dizwe Matunja. So I applied to UFX because of also I needed actually funding to actually fund what my business. So one one is developing townships small format, small format stores which are designed to be accessible within one minute. We utilize our unique one man format where we are offering products in small single unit packages mm -hmm. that align with tight budgets of low income households within those areas. Okay, no, that's good. You're actually targeting a really key demographic. So yeah. I wish you all the best with that. Thank you very much. Uh, I applied for the UFX because I believe I have a solution solution okay. um, with Texic. Texic is my company. Mm -hmm. uh, so basically we are trying to uh, to change how the taxi industry works. Okay. Um, but it's it is for the better, right? Um, so our solution involves um, not just using taxis for delivering people mm -hmm. from point A to point B, but what if we can make it better, come up with the technology uh, that can make Texas work to deliver stuff as well, to collect. Um, the reason why I applied for these awards is because I felt like I need to have my idea or my NPO um, be put out there with the impact that we've made um, to the lives of young students, mm. um, both at primary, high school and varsity. I'm going to throw it in a curveball there. Right. You've got 100,000 subscribers tuning into this video. Is it? Tell us what your, pro what your program is. Tell us how we can help you. We'd love to help. 100%. So Ask Smarty, it's a WhatsApp-based mm -hmm. chatbot that allows you as a student to ask whatever question regarding your studies okay either you are preparing for maths you want a video for business studies yeah or you want to apply for university of cape town it's going to give you answers or it's going to give you the resources that you want yeah. i'm a bit mad at you why didn't you create this earlier on when i was still studying <laughs> but okay that's okay i know my little brother will will appreciate this sure i'm a climatic founder second time youth x finalist oh no the reason why I applied for this program as it had an impact on my first startup which is in Cybertech. So I thought I should take another chance and Oh I yeah. am so excited for you. You know how Miss Essay usually when they come the second time they win. So okay, I'm gonna stick next to you just in case you get the money. But congratulations, I'm really Thank proud of you. you. Well done for coming back. I applied for the Youth X Awards because I wanted to help people who relate to the same situation like I do. So basically my project is all about transforming waste into oh, okay. eyewear like the ones I'm wearing right now okay. yes so we are actually also tackling environmental waste by reducing plastic pollution in the area and using that plastic pollution as filament for a 3d printer which prints oh, okay. out the spectacle frames Yes. And are the spectacles like are they prescription or is it um, fashion? Yes, my uh, prescription. So so far, the 3D printer prints out the spectacle frames, and then we source out the lens from a third party okay. using your eyewear prescription. Yeah, I simply applied because I need a platform. Okay. So my startup is still an idea. Want to oh. get a prototype? Want to be out there? And we know the support that NetBank gives is great. Mm -hmm. And I'm hoping that with their support, with their baking, Globana, it will open up those. Things. My startup is in Zero Fire Solution. Okay. Zero is stronger for fire. Oh. Okay. We have, we have uh, in Zero Sensor is a, we, we are producing a sensor, right? Okay. The sensor is engineered to detect fires at an early stage oh, so nice. that we have quick response so we can save lives quicker. 
Oh my word, that, okay. Did you hear about that recent incident in Job? Yeah. The reality is, unfortunately, fires are enormous. Besides wildfires, even mm. like squatter camps, why is it? We live in Gauteng. Every single year, you hear they left a heater, caught fire, and then a line of shakes are burning. So, yeah. And the main reason I applied for the Youth X Awards is because I feel like my business addresses a critical issue. So basically, we build modern gaming cabinets, okay. uh, which are coin operated, and we put them in local shops. So mm -hmm. your townships, Skoka, C, and um, it's basically making modern gaming trends accessible to okay. the kids who can afford uh, these expensive consoles. Their own consoles. devices, their own consoles. I hope you do some educational games in there too. Yeah, yeah. You'll yeah. try your best. Yeah, we also want to integrate um, games that were developed by Africans okay. uh, so that they also have a platform to showcase their the talent. Right. And I applied for YouthX because I believe my company can change the world, can change South Africa, many South Africans' lives, not just South Africans' lives, but uh, another, another guy another. outside the country, somewhere okay. in Europe. It's, it's global. You know. And tell us a bit impact. more about your, your business. What is it? Because we also want our world to be changed. So yeah, tell us a bit more. Yeah, it's, uh, we are a mobile car wash. We come to you at the comfort of your home or workplace. Okay, got you, got you. And let me tell you, I need that mobile car wash because I hate going to the car wash. And I basically applied uh, to the Youth X program uh, mainly because I, I feel like my idea has the potential to change uh, people's lives, especially the deaf community. All right, so my idea is it's mainly it's called uh, Signify. Uh, which okay. is like just a, an extension that you can put in a browser okay. which basically help uh, bridge the gap so let me just make an, a quick an example mm -hmm. uh, you know how us uh, how we engage with online content yeah you know we've got youtube videos all, all yeah. that sort of stuff Scrolling. yeah yeah, not, yeah. yeah that. so our we, we notice that there's a gap where when it comes to the deaf community they don't really experience the or have the same engagement as we do so what we're trying to do is sort of uh, bridge that gap uh, through like translating the, the actual content in real time to a sign language yeah oh i love yeah, that yes, and you know our new miss essay is actually also deaf oh, so it's like yes, yes, it's, yes. it's perfect thing. yeah and so if you're doing something and i know a lot of people are going to appreciate it and yes. this is not just a south african thing it's yes. going to change yeah, the yes. world um i'm the founder and ceo of aerogreen so okay. the reason why i applied for the youth x awards was mainly because i sort of saw it as an opportunity to join a community of you know entrepreneurs and innovative people mm -hmm. and that really resonated with me especially since I'm you know a budding entrepreneur yeah. so I am looking for that ecosystem of support whether it's financially you know advisory or with all the other perks that youth X tell me what do you wish to gain with your collaboration with youth X because you're a finalist so we yeah. know you've won we're just not sure what so. it's mainly um, networking okay. um, meeting the the minds of uh, young people brilliant minds um, and also to receive the gray hair knowledge mm -hmm. that is going to help me my organization mm -hmm. be able to reach the millions of young people out there and if you've got any question ask smarty okay no I, I definitely hope that the people who are watching will definitely take you up on that what I'm hoping to gain is basically networking in the environmental space mm -hmm. because NetBank has um, programs that support what I'm trying to build, which is which are two systems to decarbonize the air okay. um, due to mineral mining that causes carbon emissions in the air. Oh, okay. And also the second system that we are developing, um, creating renewable energy by using um, waste that will uplift like entrepreneurs in the petroleum industry and provide affordable gas and petrol to you. That seems really technical. Is yes. it safe to assume that you studied something in a similar field Not or really. you just saw the need? A, I do have a co-founder okay. that's in the biotech industry, but my mother works in this industry. Oh. I love it. No, the I love most it. impactful thing would likely be, you know, the, the mentorship support and, okay, yeah, the, the financials yeah. as well. We're at a place where we need the financial uh, muscle mm -hmm. to grow our business. Yeah, so, so obviously uh, uh, the, the money would no, really you help. Don't you know, the money. You're an entrepreneur. Yeah. The money is important. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So especially at, the, at this stage, because mm -hmm. it's starting, still starting out, mm -hmm. and it would help scale the business and also encourage other young uh, young entrepreneurs out there. Uh, definitely um, networking, uh, a bit of network, a bit of support, and obviously funding to grow the baby and uh, put it out there so people can see it grow and then can touch me lives, car owners, mm -hmm. so they don't have to stress about uh, 
having to go having to go to your car wash ever again. Okay, make sure you you scale this thing. It mustn't just be a jobbing thing because I yes. need you in Cape Town. Yeah, and I know the rest yeah. of the world needs you. I'm from Cape Town, so yeah. Really? One Pretorian, but yeah. Ah, okay, no, we, we'll see each other in Cape Town. Even I'm hoping to gain exposure okay. and reach out basically a market reach to those that really do need glasses and affordable eyewear. No, the demand exists, I'll tell <laughs> the you that. The demand yes, and glasses are ridiculously expensive. Yeah, and it's actually something that you can't you control. Need, like I the, did not ask the, to not see. Exactly. <laughs> no, I've got not you. Sure what, so. you know, one of the things in which I've been looking into, I've been looking more into personal branding, so this will allow me to also really reinvent myself in the okay. public. And also, and also, if you can look at spas that have been known as these and a low standard retailer so i wanted to also like increase the standards of spiral shops okay. and actually build something that is better than spiral shops get a prototype okay. like i said yeah you've said i realized <laughs> I, realize, I, I said you mentioned it you know a lot of people like you you <laughs> got it you got it. Got it. <laughs> no you got it also you're gonna get that mentorship because yes. they do give you that and i think when you are starting out as an entrepreneur the money is great of course but if you don't know what to do with it you can squander it so I, I love that you have applied for that obviously guidance <laughs> um the money is good uh, but you also need guidance mm. you need people of being in the industry, mm. people who, who know what they're doing, or have been doing it for a long time. Um, so yeah. For, for us, it's not just only about the money. Mm -hmm. um, we believe that the mentorship okay. will, will, will help us grow in terms of uh, from systems to collaborations and um, yeah. And even sourcing the team that can actually do some of these things, I think that's very smart. Yeah. And I just want to actually remind the people who are watching that NetBank, well YouthX by NetBank rather, does not only provide financial support, they also give you mentorship. So this is really important because as an entrepreneur, if you get money, yes it's great, trust me I know as an entrepreneur, but you also need the intellectual support. You need someone who's actually going to give you some strategy or be a sounding board so i really think that you are going to get that and you're at the right place with youth x um and my last question for you is what are your plans for the future my plans for the future i think my mission is to solve african problems that requires technology mm -hmm. and if solved they can trans transition africa into its pro uh, prosperity era okay. thank you so much that is our first okay. contestant sure that's a very big question. Um, the future could be next week. You know, you okay. can tell me that next week you want to <laughs> run. The plans for the future, uh, they're definitely big. Um, okay. But maybe if I win this competition, mm -hmm. uh, no, I hope I will. Um, We're we crossing can, fingers here. Yes. <laughs> I want to roll out with Texic. I uh, work with a lot of people in the industry, taxi okay. owners. Just give them the incentive uh, to show them the potential in their industry. Um, and in the longer future, I really want to have a lot of startups okay. with a lot of solutions for okay. the community. Okay, it's giving so, yeah. venture capitalists, okay. <laughs> all I'm going to say is all the best. And when you do start, try to start with the small association. And then when it works, they scale yeah. it up. And then, you know, I, I definitely think you're onto something. My plans for the future is to see more young people being able to reach their fullest potential, regardless of their background, where they come yeah. from because our country we've got a very disproportional mm. um, scale in terms of exposure in terms of opportunities so this platform is really there to break the barriers of circumstantial uh, background that you might be coming from more so children from rural areas mm. so we are saying regardless where you are as so long as you've got a phone if you've got a question regarding what you're studying you're next learning. and whatever that you are dealing with currently at school, yeah. ask Smarty. And you know what, there's actually a stat that says uh, South Africans don't all have access to a bank account, but almost everyone has access to a cell phone. So I really do believe that you're tapping into a really critical market. But for those of you who are looking for bank accounts, I really would recommend that you check out the NetBank My Goals. They range from 5 Rand per month all the way to 240, depending on what you're looking for. But you know, Nkosi over here has got a really great thing and I actually can't wait to see it happening. I can't wait to see it in the market. I will be keeping an eye out for you. Thank you so much. Thank you so much for the All opportunity. Right. I hope we'll see you Thank in you. the future. What I'm hoping for in the future is to be known for what I build and to establish my two businesses, but mainly focusing on climate impact and environmental impact and 
reducing carbon emissions in the air and having an impact in renewable energy, like okay. the, just energy transition. Well, you're with the right bank because Ned Bank is green and green yes. is good in this environment. In the future, I do hope my project and I have reached the stage where we want to be. We've made impact mm -hmm. in the community. I hope to teach learners about this amazing technology which is a 3d printer it's not just used for spectacle frames but you can use it oh for yeah anything you want really i think our plan for the future is for our product to be out there we want to save lives but most importantly we want to create jobs youth unemployment is high we want to at least play a hand in actually creating jobs okay, so now for the future kenyaka for tusa the youth okay i want i want to um, I want the youth to re econo coda, econo creator the game, okay. and uh, sponsor bona, econo distribute. Okay. No, I love that, and you touched on coding, and that's quite a critical skill right now. Deep down, I'm an I'm an entrepreneur. I'm a mm -hmm. technological entrepreneur. So my plans for the future is to see my industry growing, the okay. industry of the coward industry growing. I want to see uh, many ideas coming out of different people. So mm -hmm. I believe that technology can change. A lot, so I just want to see the future being technology. Uh, basically, uh, I, I could say I want to see, you uh, know, uh, have, have been uh, in the space whereby where we've got uh, inclusivity when it comes to uh, engaging with online content. Mm -hmm. You know, uh, want any barriers. So my, my our slogan for the for for my platform is called break, breaking barriers okay. one sign at a time. So. Like oh, having that's that's, that's so the goal. Yeah, yeah, so breaking yes. barriers yeah, one, one sign, sign at, at a time. time. Yeah, okay, yeah, yeah. I'm gonna ask you an extra question. Okay, okay, sure. Is there someone in your family or within your friends who is deaf? Is this a, a, a project that's close to your heart? Or I'd say it is close to my heart, but okay. I do not have anybody who's close. But I do have a friend okay. uh, who has who knows someone uh, who, who has, who this, has this, this. Yeah, yeah. yeah so that's what basically sparked the, the passion inside of me, you know, wanting to help the community. I love it and I know even us as consumers are going to enjoy yeah, being able yes. to pick up on some of the signs. Yes, I know yes. the only thing I can do is I love you, right? Same. So I, I love, love you. you. And right. also there's hello and thank you. Oh, and hello you. and thank, thank, you. thank you. Okay, I'm going to say thank you so thank much. You. For uh, plans for the future is definitely getting my uh, uh, shipping container farms okay. off the ground and uh, starting to access the market and commercializing my product. Okay. Yeah. All the best. Is there anything you want to say? You've got a hundred thousand people who are tuned in. <laughs> Is there anything you want to plug? Uh, yeah. Uh, follow us on LinkedIn. We're AeroGreens. Uh, we make vertical farming easy. Okay. Thank you yeah. so much. All right. Cool. I am sitting here with John. I'm actually going to allow John to introduce himself because I don't want to do a long, lengthy intro. You can just tell us your name, cool. who you are. And anything interesting, if you want. Oh, cool. Um, I'm John okay. Machato. I'm the head of uh, youth strategy and CVP at NetBank okay. in the retail banking sp space. Okay. Yeah, that's my job day to day. Um, otherwise, by night or by, <laughs> by weekend, <laughs> by night and by weekend, I'm, yeah. I'm, I'm a Batman. I, I, I like doing like adventure stuff, you know, okay. going skydiving, um, adrenaline go karting. Yeah, yeah. I've got four questions for you. The first one being, mm what made you guys create the my goals account like what is the reason you guys came up with it is it just another account or is there an actual demand that you guys are serving yeah so when we went on the journey to create the my goals suites so there's three accounts in there mm -hmm. there's the my goals the my goals plus and the my goals premium yes we wanted to simplify our offerings to the market just make it very simple there's, there's three um, products you can choose choose from and each with a distinct set of benefits right and with the MyGoals account specifically, I think it's more geared towards the student youth market. Okay. So yeah. I know with the MyGoals account, they have this thing called the My Pockets, which I love. That's actually yeah. my favorite feature. <laughs> so my question is, what is something that people can do or how do you believe that the MyGoals account can actually help young people set better financial goals? Look, firstly, I think um, the MyGoals account, like I said, for young people, it's priced for them. Yeah. So it's free up until the age of 18 years old. Oh, it's free. Okay, I didn't know about that. I just know the lowest is five rand. I didn't know it was free. No, no, no. It's free up until you're 18 years old. And yeah, from 18 still, years old, that counts. it's five bucks. 
you know, um, which is priced very, very, very well. So okay. again, you don't have to, to worry ab ab about um, the price of your banking mm -hmm. so much, right? And um, within that, right, in our money app is what we call My Smart Money. Okay. Where you can track exactly where you're spending your, your money. Um, also, you can budget and, 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 and look exactly where your money is, is going, right? Okay. Versus where you wanted it to, to go. Mm -hmm. What that does, right, when you track your money, you know, flip, I'm spending too much money at, um, I don't know, at a certain place <laughs> where you should be spending more money or, or saving in, in other places uh, as well. So tracking your money and your financial um, mm. and your financial b b behavior helps you create better habits. I love that. I think you guys are actually digitizing something that we've been doing 100%. quite manually. Because yes, I know my dad used to tell me you must print out your bank statements, highlight every no, month. It's, it's right there for it's right there for Now that we're at the Y824 Fest, of course, I do want to ask you guys what inspired this? I mean, I, I love the groove, guys. I, I don't mind groove. Yeah. So tell us, Net Bank, groove. Look, so we have got, I guess YouthX, right, has got three pillars. Um, in which we've got our live events, mm -hmm. um, YouthX Awards and this festival. Yeah. So I'll just stick to YouthX Awards and this festival. YouthX yeah. Awards is where young people will come to us and enter um, any ideas that they have or businesses or anything that they're passionate about um, and they enter a competition where they'll get rewarded with money and business support and, and all of that. And the festival right, was created to celebrate young people and to celebrate the, their, their ingenuity, their innovation okay. and their resilience, right? And uh, we thought in the past, I think, when we started off, it was like a quite a formalish summit mm -hmm. and then it iterated in 2022 and last year we were here and now it's a full-blown festival with music, food, people are playing games. It's, it's really like it's a... I mean, I'm just looking around. My last question for you, John, yeah. is for those who are watching this, who didn't get a chance to come through, how can they approach YouthX to access some of their benefits? Is there something that they can do? Do they head over to any NetBank branch? Do they go online? No, yeah, people love digital stuff. Of course. I asked so, that on, <laughs> quite, on purpose. No, no, no. Don't go to the branch. <laughs> <laughs> Please. Um, so you, you can catch us on our socials. Okay. You can look for YouthX um, on X. Mm -hmm. You can look for uh, unlocked dot uh, unlocked un underscore ZA, ZA on Instagram. Mm -hmm. um, you can look for unlocked dot me on the web browser as well. You find all information that is youthx and and my goals as well. No, thank you so much, John. I know that I've enjoyed this conversation. I know whoever's yeah. watching it will also enjoy it. Cool, thank you so much for joining me. I'm going to be asking you three or four questions. And the first one is, what is your name? And how does it feel to have won <laughs> last year's Youth X Awards? Yeah, thank you very much for having me today. Um, my name is Vian Yubai. And uh, yeah, no, it's been amazing. It's a, been a crazy experience to see kind of from that moment how things have changed okay. until now. A lot has happened, um, but yeah, no, it's been an amazing experience. I am, I'm so happy for you, and I'm actually so happy to be speaking to someone who actually <laughs> won. Now we see, like, you know how it rolls out. So <laughs> yeah. tell us a bit about your business. What is it that you do? Did you pitch the same thing that you still do? Have you had some iterations? So long story short, if you, I don't know if you guys can see this jacket, but this is basically what I do. Okay. Um, so, yeah, long story short, let me actually start with what I pitched last year. Mm -hmm. So I pitched Drip Markets, which was an app where people could buy and sell second and clothes. Oh, okay. Very similar to Yaga okay. for those who okay, know. Got you. We actually pivoted from that so now to actually being an in-person um, business. Okay. So we sell high-end second-hand clothes oh. um, and we're actually uh, in the process of opening a store in Stanley Studios which is right across 44 Stanley. The name of the store is Fabric Hunter. No, I will definitely leave the details in the description box if you guys are looking for these high-end luxury second-hand items. I definitely want to check that out. I hope you have some things that I will No, like. of course. We're setting up today. So really? you can check it out uh, for no, sure. I'm gonna I'm gonna come to your store. I wanna see. <laughs> Tell us a bit more about how YouthX has actually helped you with this. What type of support do they give you? Is this something you'd recommend for other people who are looking to enter this entrepreneurial life? Yeah, yeah, no, so for sure. I think like I said, it's uh it's it had a big impact. Um, I think obviously because of the prize, you obviously mm -hmm. get a cash prize, um, you get a curated experience, but I'll talk a little bit more about that mm -hmm. now. Um, yeah, but you also get access to a network, right? Okay. I mean, they invited us back now to this year's Youth mm -hmm. X and we can actually showcase our pieces. So it's very nice exposure, you know? And I think as a young person, it's always good to put yourself out there. Um, and yeah, you never know what's
what what can happen. So um, so yeah, no, it's been amazing. And about the curated experience, so um, NetBank is actually helping us launch our store, um, oh. which is a really cool yeah add on now. So that is so nice. They've held your hand through it. Exactly. They're still there with you, yes. even though we're about to get a new winner. Yes, but they're yeah. still there with you. No, I exactly. love that for you. Yeah. My last question is. What would you like to tell the current finalists of the YX24 Fest? First of all, just enjoy it. It's, it's honestly an amazing experience. You get to meet so many new people from different walks of life. So I would say that's the first thing. The second thing is, um, yeah, I think be smart with, you know, obviously what you've, what you've gotten to know and what you actually are going to receive. With the money, um, you know, spend it wisely. Yeah. Um, and again, with the people, you know, these aren't just people you meet for a day. These are people you meet for, um, yeah, a whole lifetime, and you get to know them, and you create connections. So, um, yeah, no, no that's, I love that's this. what Thank I would say. Thank you so much. 100%. Thank you so much for having this conversation. No, I think sure. I'm Thank also excited. Me. I'm not even a finalist, <laughs> but the fact that you know they've taken you through this whole process is actually so comforting yeah. for me. are definitely planting seeds in my head and I can't wait to water them if you have enjoyed this please do tip me with a like and if you would like to find out more about youth eggs please do make sure you visit their unlock.me website and you will find everything there I get guys is a one later it's time for me to go and actually enjoy the concert bye